Good morning, everybody, and welcome to today's devotion for August 22nd. Today's devotion is titled, Faithful Until the Harvest. And the Bible reading is from Galatians chapter 6, verses 7 to 10. Do not be deceived. God cannot be mocked. A man reaps what he sows. Whoever sows to please their flesh from the flesh will reap destruction. Whoever sows to please the Spirit from the Spirit will reap eternal life. Let us not become weary in doing good, for at the proper time we will reap a harvest if we do not give up. Therefore, as we have opportunity, let us do good to all people, especially to those who belong to the family of believers. A woman I know planned an event at a local park and invited all the neighborhood children to participate. She was excited about the opportunity to share her faith with her neighbors. She recruited her three grandchildren and two high school students to help her um, to help her, gave the assignments, planned a number of games and other activities, prepared food, prepared a Bible story about Jesus to, pre- to present to the children, and waited for them to gather. Not a single child showed up the first day. Uh, or the second day. Or the third day. Yet each day, my friend went through that day's activities with her grandchildren and helpers. On the fourth day, she noticed a family picnicking nearby and invited the children to join in the games. One little girl came, entered into the fun, ate with them, and listened to the story about Jesus. Perhaps years from now, she'll remember. Who knows what the outcome will be? God, through the book of Galatians, encourages us, let us not become weary in doing good, for at the proper time we will reap a harvest if we do not give up. Therefore, as we have opportunity, let us do good to all people. Don't worry about numbers or other visible measures of success. Our job is to be faithful to what he wants us to do, and then leave the harvest to him. God determines the outcomes. What best laid plans of yours have gone wrong? How can you learn to trust God with the outcome despite disappointment? Thank you for joining me for today's devotion, and I hope you all have a wonderful day.